Tonight, school leaders in Marshalltown are trying to figure out what is causing more than a dozen people at their high school to feel sick. Students and teachers started developing symptoms that seemed like carbon monoxide poisoning Tuesday. But as only Mark KCCI's Marcus McIntosh shows us, the answer may not be as simple. Marcus. Virtual learning this Friday here at Marshalltown High School because construction caused a smell and visible fumes inside the building that allegedly made some people sick. Sophomore Isaac Scales is well aware of the smell on the first floor of the high school building he says made him and others sick. And very many people going home sick with headaches and migraines and stuff like that. Scales says it had him on the verge of throwing up. He believes the source of the smell is related to construction in the courtyard. It's a lot of like gas smell and then there's been weird fish smells and like different types of like just strange smells throughout it. We reached out to Unity Point Waterloo and received this statement that reads in part, it's Marshalltown ER has treated 14 patients for symptoms consistent with carbon monoxide exposure. The Marshalltown School District tells us swift action was taken when teachers started complaining of smells. Building administration had immediately asked for the construction to be shut down. Air quality monitors that were in the basement were brought onto the first floor where the problem was and all readings were below the threshold of concern at that time. Superintendent Dr. Theron Schutte says carbon monoxide is something the district tests for and immediately tested for after people got sick and continues to test for. We are not finding evidence of a source of where that problem came from. I'm not saying that there isn't a, there wasn't a problem. We have not found any evidence of high degrees of carbon monoxide in the building. Dr. Schutte adds Friday's virtual learning was a safety measure to help the school community feel safe. Students will be back in the classroom Monday morning. In Marshalltown, Marcus McIntosh, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.